Cole said this benefit is captured in the MOA signed on the 17th of December 2023 where teachers will be paid allowances at the end of the academic year for three years. However, the allowance benefit has been divided into three categories, which Cole explains. It's going to be paid to teachers who are teaching in the remote parts of the country, remote. And then the second part of the allowance, it will be paid to teachers who are teaching in very remote parts of the country. And then there is the third one. The last one is extreme remote. Extreme remote is very important for those teachers who are teaching in remote part of the country. Co further elaborates on the allowance teachers will be paid. Teachers who are teaching in those kind of schools, they will be paid 7,000 kina allowance. So reflected in the MOA. In the very remote, we will pay 6,000. The government is prepared to pay 6,000 kina to these very remote schools. And then in remote schools, government will be paying teachers teaching in remote schools 5,000 kina. He clarified that spouses who teach in the same school will also receive their allowances individually. He is now calling on education authorities in each province to categorize schools in their respective provinces to make administrative work easy in order for the allowances to be paid to teachers. Cole said such negotiation is the first PNGTA achieved for teachers to benefit while taking on the challenge to serve the nation. He said this understanding was also supported by the Teaching Service Commission and the government. Gladys Killer, National and TV News.